Welcome to the Average Rook. We're still playing Wolves and Lords of Mayhem. We spent enough time trying to delve into the smuggler's pass, and we're just about to reach the necropolis. Let's not waste any more time and get on with the shooting. You shoot. You are going to die. Another level up for the Avenger auto turret. That's just gonna have to do. Okay, shoot that, shoot that, shoot these. So I've decided to try something a little different. Though not entirely useful. I'm going to play and record these two episodes with these sunglasses on. For no reason whatsoever. It seems we've caught up with the sleepers. Boots and chest This keys. is the tail end of the unholy procession that went through here. The cult of the sleeper has much to answer for. Hopefully they do. Get rid of that soul spawn there. We, uh, burning damage, goddamn. Destroy you! Ready to throw some husks. Moving arrows. Right, let's take a look at these. It's rated arrows. All damage is now dealt instantly after skill activation, but damage is reduced. I don't want that. How about this. Let's see. Reduces cooldown. Turret stays active for a longer duration. That. Ah, so he has a it's not possible. teleportation. Yeah, you weren't gonna hide from me. That stone is down. That guy's dead. We've got a sovereign shout. Um, unleash a powerful war cry which buffs attack speed and cast speed for yourself and nearby allies. Only usable with melee weapons. Which means I can't use it at the moment. I'll probably store it in the chest. Let's go into this uh, special area and kill the Lord Soul Spawn. Let's get to it. So you may think it's kind of stupid trying to play um, this game or any particular game that is kind of dark or just any game in general with sunglasses on. And technically speaking, you might be right. In fact, you probably are right. There's no real reason for me to be uh, wearing these sunglasses while I'm playing this video game, or making these recordings. I'm doing it for the heck of it. There's no, um, there's no guarantee that this is going to improve the experience, apart from seeing how well I do when this, um, when these sunglasses make me partially blind, but I'm just wearing these for uh, bleeps and giggles. There's a cursed chest over there. What does that helmet do? It's a rogue, 57 health, and a four shield, five movement speed, ferocity, critical chance, health on this item. Yeah, keep it, but I might sell it. Let's try this cursed chest and get through all of this. That took a good chunk of my health. Let's hope all of these items were worth it. All right, let's see what we got. We got some pants. Uh, we got a bruiser, 72 health and 16 all resistance score. It has an 8% re health regeneration rate with 3.1 health regeneration, 17, 32 all resistance. Doesn't have damage. Um, let's, uh, let's put this on for the time being and continue on our merry way. I cannot reach you. There I can reach you. Ah-ha. Uh -huh. I will last you. There we go. 
That's the rewards that I get. Jeez. Final grab something to sell. Okay, we all good, we all fine. There's another chest over there. It doesn't give me anything useful. All right, let's move it on. We've got a long way to go. Does that thing just fire in a straight line and not actually move towards enemies? I hope there's a special that allows it to move towards enemies. Now let's pick up this. We've got a common health potion and that's about all the use that we can get out of that. Oh, you decided to show up. Well, you're dead now. We got reduces cooldown, increased turret damage. Eh. There's a scarab over there. Okay, let's try getting rid of that first. Well, okay. Let's pick up this garbage and promptly go back to town in order to sell the stuff. I'll be right back. Okay, I am back. And my computer worrying something a little bit fierce. Luckily, I speak louder than the fan seems to be picking up. Now, did I miss anything down here while I was trying to... trying to murder that golden scarab? I missed a few boxes. It says. Okay, that. And that was it. Alright, let's continue moving down this way. Shambling deviants. I'm unstoppable. You can go back to hell. All right. I'm um, assuming nothing's going to be chasing us. So let's move up a little bit here, and then we can do this. Let's give it to that. That'll do. On to this. Let's see. Spell casting speed score. I don't need. Um, attack damage and nine percent critical chance to uh, gain additional scam up. There. Increase your passive dodge chance score. Hmm. Let's go up this way. I don't know if I'll actually get around to getting into this area or this area. I might end up trying to fill out this area before I do. I still need to filter through and see which branches I actually want to take. The customization aspect of this game is very, very vast. I mean, I don't want to turn my character into too much of a freak. I want to actually put some sense into what upgrades I give it. I gotta be a little bit tactful. Of course, that might just go out the window and I'll just willy-nilly put whatever I want to it with no sense at all, which is a good possibility. Okay, so it doesn't actually, uh... It's very annoying. Oh, well, maybe they're, um... Wonder, let me just go over here. Substruct protocol. Twin repeater turret gates and additional cannon. Autonomous sensors. Turrets can now rotate and auto-target enemies. I have to wait until level 17. Maybe I can use the Primordial Affinity to level it up to 17 and then it can auto-target. A turret's not that much useful if it can't auto-target. Oh, come on. Okay, we all done with that stupidity? Helmet, chipped amber. 
Mark of Impurity? Cause a target. No, Curse is a target, increasing the damage it receives. So we cast Hex. Learning it. They will regret standing in my way. I might. Oh, uh, skill button. I might want to equip that. Come on. To five. To five. Oh. Do I have to unlock it or something? Where did that go? I want wailing arrows on that one. Can't I use it on that? No. I'm just I'm gonna have to wait. All right, let's uh, let's move on. Not waste any time. And kill these son of a guns up the steps. We are close to reaching the end of this of this necropolis. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Okay. Anything up here? No. Stupid husks. Hey, I said stupid husks. Don't have to repeat myself about the stupid husks. I'm taking so the time to smell. Soul spawn. There's a fully fledged demon down there. A demon. Just for me. I should never have come here. Alone. What was I thinking? Well, hindsight's only 2020. So we've reached the end. We methinks we might have a boss battle the moment we go through. Never mind. Let's activate this ter um portal. Um, we're still good. And we've still got quite a bit of time. Let's get a companion. We got a rat. Eh, rats are okay. This is not the tiny rodent from Hades. That one's just a dick. A carrion fang swammer. You stupid forsaken. How dare you damage my rat. No way across this chasm. Unless I free those bones. That might do it. Bones. Great sword. Catalyst. Spolder. What does this do? Cast a cone of shadow force that knocks back enemies and destroys projectiles. Only usable with staves or catalysts. <laughs> uh, never mind. Let's get this. Uh, not worth it. Not worth it at all. Okay, up here there must be something I can kill. Got to destroy. Don't suppose anything's gonna pop up the moment I get too close. Got a thing. Oh. Were those the bones I was trying to free? Okay. All right. Going on to the other side. What? Oh my goodness, what in the world is that? Was that thing sapping my rage? Or did I just not generate enough? Alright. That should be it. Now we should be able to get across that chasm. Easy peasy. Oh, the air is freezing. I must be getting close. But to what? Stop it! Stop clicking! Did I automatically pick that up? I can't do that. Awesome. Okay, that doesn't seem to do anything. That's good. Alright, still good for inventory. Not entirely good on time, though. I'm gonna have to stop in just a few minutes. That is a lot of spiders. Okay. Sword. I wonder if I should just not bother with picking those particular ones up. 
How are we going? Uh, still got a lot to go. I'm gonna try to get to the end of this place. And then I might stop and make another episode. How much do I need for that? I need three for the autonomous sensors. Some special boots. Uh, 55 health, six, oh, resistance score, that's technically better. It doesn't have the resistance score, well, it's all resistances, so it should be fine. Uh, plus 14% elemental damage. Uh, no extra stamina points. Same ferocity. And no, but no passive dodge chance score. It's level 15, though, so let's equip it. Okay, 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 okay. Did I just destroy that? I did. Pretty sure that's bad luck. Oh, I've got the stupid thing here. I wanted to go away. Now I need to apply a status effect on myself. You can't do that. My rat is still s soldiering on. I leveled up again. All right, let's get rid of that. Um. Confirm, accept this. Move into a toughness, that. Confirm, X. I think the, um, the audio in this is just a little bit out of sync. And that might have something to do with the game itself, not my recording, um, uh, tech. Okay, this. The chest in the distance. I want that chest. I want that chest. Oh boy. Still going strong. I take it I don't get anything when I destroy those tombstones. Common willpower potion. Oh. A higher tier, um, insertable. I'll keep that and take a look at it properly later. Okay, there's a cursed chest right there. This, 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 and this, and a bit of gold. All right. Let us get this. Out of the way. Luckily, we managed to hold on to our, um... Okay. Not enough room. Uh, heck, I'm gonna have to go back. Just give me a couple of seconds. Well, actually, give me one second. Okay, I'm back. I decided to use some of my uh, primordial, primordial affinity to level up my Avenger Auto Turret to 21. I thought it would give me a lot more um, uh, skill points to uh, allocate into stuff, but it didn't. So I took away, uh, I took away the uh, the thing I had before and opened up the uh, the auto turret function, the uh, the auto tracking. So let's see what happens. Yeah, there we go. That is very good. And I'm guessing that only works when it's down there, as opposed to holding it up. Oh, what in the world is that? Let's, um... Yeah, let's do it. Let's make what this episode now? a little bit longer. But I may have to cut the, uh, the... Down, the... Bastards. <sighs> I'll have to cut the bit rate down if I want to put this up. Uh-huh. It might not be too late to return to the warmth of the surface. Find a new life. Forget about this foolish endeavor. I don't think I can. Uh, something is in my head. 
I must break the pedestal before I lose it. Why are you here? What are you trying to achieve? Where I don't quite know myself. Let's deal with this stuff quickly. Orb one, broken. Orb two, broken. Ugh. Stupid necromancers. Oh, don't you do that to me. Orb number three, broken. Orb number four, the broken. The dome is ruptured, and the dark whispers have stopped. Yeah, but I don't think it means too much. Of that helmet I missed. Now return to apparently this baddie. Oh boy, oh he's ripping me apart. The way Dead. Down is clear. All right, crude Alexandrite. Pick up these. A mace, a willpower potion, a staff I don't necessarily need. And now let's go down the stairs. Hopefully I'll be able to, um... Do I just click it? Okay. The necropolis itself is freezing. Yeah, it is. Oh, the summoning can't be stopped now. The devourer shall feast on their soul. Come now. Let us greet the interloper. Yeah, we'll probably deal with him in the next episode. So, we got through the bit of that, um, Necropolis, so in the next episode we'll be moving through the rest of the debts and getting to wherever the he um, whoever the heck that person was. So, thank you so much for stumbling onto one of the most average gaming channels out there. Like and subscribe for more if you enjoy the video. Check the corresponding playlist, assuming it pops up, or any of the recommended that comes up below it. I'm the Average Rook, see you soon, and more average content coming your way.